Hey guys, and welcome to another Clash Clans video. Today, we're going to be looking at a Town Hall 11 base built by my clanmate here, Ro, from YM Academy. What's so special about this base is it's, it's his first attempt at building a Town Hall 11 base for Lee War, and it ended up getting 8 defenses against Burning Chicken in our CWL Phoenix match uh, against them a couple of weeks ago. So, we're going to take a look at the base as we see right now. And we're going to take a look at a couple of attacks and see uh, how they went wrong and what uh, makes this base so interesting. So first off, we will look at a couple of the traps here. Uh, we have a picture of the traps here. So we have basically the the um, Inferno Towers in the bottom section of the base, closer to the Town Hall, which means that you can't have a wall wrecker entry directly into the infernos which makes it a little bit harder to do uh tr to do strategies with lower with large amounts of smaller troops in them because they, they get fried by the double inferno and because if you queen charge into there it'll take you a long time before you get into the uh, clan castle so usually what they would do is queen charge into the eagle uh, with the sort of strategic strats and with the other strats, we're going to take a look at them right now, is a P.E.K.K.A. P.E.K.K.A. Boulder attack. So creating the funnel now, and eventually going to drop everything into the sort of into the top side of the base, and try to go across the middle and into the town hall. So double quake or one quake into the base with the double ice golems. That's what I meant. He's going to lead the way for the Pekkas and the Boilers to just smash into the base and try to get all the way down to the middle, uh, through the middle and into the final Inferno. Uh, use the Warden ability early to protect against the traps that are in there. Uh, Boilers would have, been, would have been absolutely smashed by that uh, giant bomb. And with the Siege Barracks, you're able to put uh, Hog Riders in the Siege Barracks and that's going to get the Hog Riders into the side of the base, or the side of the, uh, uh, smashing the side defenses. But they aren't going to be able to get enough value for, uh, a as he would like. And with the middle troops, through the jump spell, they're not able to get to the Inferno very quickly. And ends up being all the heroes die out, or all the heroes are the last things up in the base. And they're eventually going to die out to this back end Tesla farm and the back end point defenses. So they're able to get quite a ways through the middle, able to get the town hall as well, but they're just not able to get those side defenses that are really important for these kinds of raids because you have to get through the middle and through the side defense in order to take down the base, obviously. So with that out of the way, you're not able to get uh, all the defense that he wants it, and that's going to end up in a 80-something percent two-star. So how does a base get eight defenses in a war? We're going to take a look at why a base could get eight defenses in a war very quickly, or very soon. And the basic reason is you try out one strategy, and that strategy doesn't work, but it's really close. So you keep doing it, keep doing it, keep doing it, keep making mistake, keep making mistake after mistake, and it just ends up being a complete fail. So here it is. You notice the clock, 57 seconds on that raid. So basically what happens here is the same thing that happens multiple times on this base. And it makes one mistake, healers on the king, and that's going to spiral out of control, and he's not going to be able to make it, and just ends up... Um, and it ends up, um, what's the, what's the term? Um, <laughs> what's the term? Rage quitting. He ends up rage quitting. So CC comes out. CC is, um, uh, Baby Dragon and, what, well, Valks? Yeah, Baby Dragon and Valks. So that helps out quite a bit against Queen Chargers because Valks have a lot of HP and the level 50 Queen at Town Hall 11 isn't uh, as strong as you would like it to be in order to take down those sorts of troops. 
queen goes down, and that is about it for the raid. So I hope you enjoy the base. I hope you learned something. I've been Raised Gaming, and I'm out.